Hello everyone, welcome to this video. Thank you very much for clicking on it. I really appreciate it. Today, B2B are back. Well, technically they were back yesterday, but I'm here today to watch it. <laughs> so <laughs> B2B are back uh, with a new title track and mini album, Wind and Wish. Same title for both. Um, I'm looking forward to it. I have not, here's the thing with B2B is I never really know what I'm gonna get when I go into a new release from them. Like, am I gonna get beautiful ballads? Am I gonna get something a bit more upbeat and funky? I have no idea. And I haven't seen any teasers in the lead up to this either. So I'm just kind of like, we'll see what happens, I guess. Um, <clears throat> but yeah, so we're gonna get into this. I will, of course, uh, be doing a reaction to the rest of the album as soon as I can. If I can get to it today, amazing. I am filming this a little bit later in the day. So I don't know if I'll be able to have, be able to squeeze in the album as well, but we'll see how it goes. Otherwise, it will be like tomorrow or Friday or something. At some point this week, I will do this album um, and see what's happening in the B-sides. But yeah, let's get into this and see what they're bringing. But it has been a minute since I enjoyed some B2B content, I have to say. I should probably work on that at some point. I have a very long list of groups and content that I am trying to make my way through. So, you know. <laughs> I don't know when it'll be, but at some point I will get into more content from them because they are so entertaining and so funny and I just, yeah, it's, it's got to happen at some point. Anyway, let's get into this. Let's listen to this, watch this, see what it's all about. B2B, Wind and Wish, 3, 2, 1, go. It's my man. Mm. You always know the vocals are going to be pop. The drums. Love how he's delivered this verse. And I love his hair. Stunning. I love the instrumental breakdown he's holding onto his ear. This is really nice. I love this instrumental, it's so nice. The melodies of this are stunning. Yeah, 
my god, that went by so quickly. That was like a nearly four minute music video, right? But that went by so quickly, it felt like two minutes. Jeez. Oh, I loved that. Like I said, whenever I'm going into a B2B uh, title track, song, album, whatever, whenever I'm going into something B2B, I never quite know what I'm going to get. Uh, because they're a group that very much has the range. <laughs> and, you know, you think about, um, what was their, what was their last release called? Sorry, I'm blanking on titles. Uh, the song, there it is. You think about the song, right? And that's much more in the, the ballad vein of things. Beautiful song, but much more in the ballad vein. But even just going through that album, by the way, incredible album, but even just going through that album, the range. <laughs> like, you've got songs like the song, you've got songs like Whiskey and My Way and Higher. Like, it's insane. It's ridiculous. I love that album. It's so much fun, but you really. You, it's, it's a roller coaster going through their music. And that's great, and that's a lot of fun, but it does leave you a little bit stumped when it comes to what the hell am I meant to expect going into a new release, right? I can safely say I really didn't expect this. This kind of sound, this kind of style. But I'm really, really happy we got it. I think... You know... Sometimes... We all just really need a song that feels warm and hopeful and uplifting in the most simple of ways and i feel like that's exactly what that song was both musically and lyrically as well you know it was just it just felt good it just felt really good it's the kind of song where you listen to it it's like yes my soul has been nourished thank you <laughs> that's exactly what i needed that was beautiful i adored the instrumental for that all of the the guitars whether you had uh you had that riff the dun, 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 that thing that i can't fully remember how it went now off the top of my head because my brain is blanking but that little riff through the verses you had the strums as well <coughs> sorry um and then the drums and the percussion in general through this song was awesome the way they were using it to um create a very cinematic kind of vibe at certain parts of the song was awesome uh you had the vocals in the back with the, the chiming in with the whoa woes uh which we love to hear gives it an almost choir-esque feel even though i'm pretty sure it's just their voices i don't think they had an actual choir in there but like it gave that kind of feeling which again has that like whenever i hear a sound like that whether it is an actual choir or it's just a combination of their voices in that kind of moment it just always feels very warm and comforting and safe sounding if you know what i mean um and then yeah melodically that was stunning and just their vocals their vocals like we could all sit here all day long and sing praises about their vocals but we wouldn't be saying anything new that hasn't been said a hundred million thousand times before in the history of their career <laughs> you know um yeah that was that was beautiful that was beautiful i loved it and i look forward to hearing what the rest of this album sounds like so I'm going to end this one here. Let me know your thoughts and feelings on this song. And uh, yeah, if you're interested in my thoughts on the album, feel free to pop on over to Patreon. I have reacted to a few uh, other B2B albums over there as well. Um, so yeah. And like I said, at some point, eventually, I may get around to <laughs> some of their like variety content. Because I, I, Lord knows, I know there's so much out there and I know they are so funny. Um, but I just... I haven't got room, <laughs> I haven't got room both in my brain and in my schedule uh, to fit another group in at the moment, but soon, It'll, we'll get there. Uh, anyway, thank you guys very much for watching. I will catch you in the next one. Bye-bye.